The God of Destruction who presides over Universe 9 has now been confirmed to be Seedra, the dwarf god shown in the Dragon Ball Super introduction, and alongside Seedra, many others have been introduced, alongside one of the Kaioshins for Universe number 11, which has also been confirmed to be a Kaioshin of gentle nature who has a strong sense of justice, who values all life in the universe, and alongside this Kaioshin, where have we seen him before? We've seen him standing alongside the Clown God of Destruction, which ultimately means that that the clown god of destruction standing next to this Kaioshin is indeed the god of destruction of universe number 11. Now unlike Seedra, we don't know the nature of this god of destruction. We do understand that its supreme Kai is that of gentle nature and has a strong sense of justice, but what about the clown? Clowns aren't normally ones to have a strong sense of justice or be humble, so I'm pretty sure based on speculation, since the supreme Kai of universe number 11 is kind and humble, I think that the god of destruction from that universe might be the polar opposite. And he might be violent in nature, a sadistic and very morbid creature who craves destruction, which would only be fitting for universe number 11. Now going based off speculation alone, since we do have confirmation of universe 9, I'm pretty sure that universe number 11 might be competing relatively soon just to showcase some of its fighters off. Now again, we haven't seen any of the fighters from universe number 11, but the man cloaked in black might be the very person that Goku has been fighting in the new Dragon Ball introduction, the alien wearing the red and black suit that is, which would only tell me that this universe in particular is going to be one of the universes focused in this tournament and having to be one of the strongest among the 12 so I do think that this universe definitely has something to offer as I do believe universe 9 is going to be one of the first universes to get obliterated during the early portions of this tournament but comment down below on your overall thoughts on this supreme Kai he stands for a moral sense of justice now where have we seen that before we've seen that with Zamasu not having anything to do with this of course but Zamasu had a strong sense of justice and now having to introduce this this Kaioshin, he too also has a very sense of justice for himself, and he's a very kind and humble Kaioshin who values life. I feel the very opposite for that specific clown, because I do think the clown is going to pose a huge problem considering the fact that Seedra, the god of destruction of Universe 9, is a very undecisive and lazy deity, so I feel the very opposite about this clown. Post your comments down below, what are your overall thoughts on the Kaioshin, what are your overall thoughts on the clown and how strong he might be, and of course his fighters. I do believe that the red and black suit members might be a part of his universe but post your comments down below thank you guys for watching so very much if you guys are ready for the universal tournament to begin then go on ahead and smash that like button to defend your universe of course if you guys are new to the channel don't forget to subscribe for all that is in dragon ball news information updates discussions and of course gameplay tune in for more i am very excited to find out the name of this clown and of course dragon ball super episode number 78 is going to debut tomorrow so make sure you guys go on ahead and tune back in for the review i cannot wait to hear your feedback so far a lot of you guys have been referring to Seedra as being a very underwhelming and very lazy god I however feel the opposite because I don't think every single god of destruction needs to be the same in terms of nature you have to have those who are lazy you have to have those who are kind you have to have those who are undecisive and of course you have to have the very violent ones and I do think the clown once we get more information on him is going to be if anything one of the most dangerous god of destructions among this tournament so let me know what you guys think down below tune in for more and I'll be seeing you all in the next video. Take it easy, guys, and God bless. Peace.